Welcome to Ixia product demonstration. We are going to demonstrate how Ixia BGP LS solution can be used to establish BGP link state connection and exchange link state information. In this demo, ISIS is used to distribute the link state information. We are going to have a topology with two Ixia ports connected back to back. On these ports, BGP LS is configured along with simulated topologies of ISIS. To start with, there are two routers configured in the scenario with BGP LS and ISIS configured, and they are connected back to back. For router 1, there is a simulated topology configured with five nodes in full mesh. XCR emulation does not require additional link state configuration in BGP. It behaves like real network node to auto-learn link state information from IGP and advertises that information through BGP LS. The topology can be changed by hovering the mouse on the simulated topology and clicking on the edit topology shape. A pop-up dialog opens when the edit topology shape is clicked. Using this dialog, the shape and size of the simulated topology and scale can be altered. Now, let us go to the BGP Peer tab to enable BGP link state capability. This capability is enabled from the Capabilities sub-tab under the heading Link State Non-VPN. When this is enabled, dynamically few tabs open up. These tabs can be used to configure settings for BGP LS, also to add BGP attributes like Communities, Extended Communities, AS path and clusters to the BGP LS prefixes advertised. The BGP LS configuration tab, BGP LS ID, instance ID can be configured. Also, if user wants to send any additional TLVs along with default TLVs for the BGP LS attributes, then user can configure BGP LS TLV profile. If the user wants to send any additional predefined or custom TLV in the BGP update message. Using the BGP LS TLV profile, we can configure a set of predefined TLVs or custom TLV to send with the BGP LS attribute in BGP update message. By clicking on the BGP LS TLV profile column, a dialog for adding TLVs opens up. User can add TLVs using this dialog. Now, let us select the simulated topology configuration. We can enable traffic engineering from the simulated bridge tab. This is enabled by the checkbox for TE highlighted here. User can also provide a TE router ID. To change different values for the interface traffic engineering parameters, we can go to the simulated interfaces tab and change from here. As shown, the parameters like administrator group, metric level, and different bandwidth values can be updated from here. Let us now start the topology. Once the topology gets started, statistics view can be checked for different BGP and BGP LS statistics. User can choose the required BGP LS statistics counters to add to the aggregated statistics view. On doing a right click on the BGP peer statistics view, we click on the Stats Selector option. This opens a pop-up window for Stats Selector. Here, user can select the required BGP LS statistics and add it to the aggregated view using the arrow marks. On finishing the selection, we can click OK and Exit. As shown here, in the BGP Peer Per Port Statistics view, user can now see the BGP LS statistics getting added. Let us move now to see the captured packets. The simulated link state ISIS topology will be advertised by BGP. This is the packet capture for BGP update message. As shown, link state NLRI and BGP LS attributes gets advertised. The node name TLV here was added as an additional TLV using the TLV profile. Apart from this, the link state capability also gets advertised in the BGP open message. Now let us go to the back-to-back -back BGP router to see the link state information and topology being advertised. To see the learned info, 
we can do a right click on the row for BGP router in the BGP peer tab and it shows us the different learned info options available. From here, select the option highlighted for link state learned info. On clicking this option, two pop-up windows open. The foreground window shows the topology graph as shown here. This shows an image of how the topology looks like. On the top right corner, there are various options to change rendering of the topology display. The nodes and links can be selected and moved around to suit visually. On clicking any node or link, some useful information on the object is also displayed. For example, here it displays IGP router ID, BGP LS autonomous system number as shown on the right side. The second pop-up window in the background shows the detailed information display for all the nodes and link NLRI information learned by this router. To see the traffic engineering parameters, scroll the view more towards the end of the right side. As shown, display of traffic engineering learned info is available here. With this, we have demonstrated the use case how to test a BGP LS speaker by advertising link state topology with TE constraint. Now, let us move to a little different configuration to test a BGP LS route reflector. As you see in this scenario, two topologies on the left side are advertising link state information to the BGP LS route reflector on the right side. BGP LS route reflector is simulated by Ixia port and these ports are connected back to back. One of the topologies advertised is a ring topology and another one is a mesh topology. BGP LS route reflector is not expected to run IGP protocol. If we want to disable unnecessary ISIS messages from the advertising router, we can do it by enabling the suppress hello checkbox. When we disable it, no ISIS messages will be sent to route reflector, but ISIS link state topology information would be sent to the route reflector using BGP LS NLRIs. Now, from the BGP LS route reflector BGP peer tab, we do a right click and fetch topology information learned from the two routers. First, we get the topology for the router advertising full mesh topology. As shown, the 5 node full mesh topology is learned in the route reflector. Now, we repeat it for the router advertising ring topology. As shown, the 10 node ring topology is learned in the route reflector. Thank you for your time. Please watch our other product videos for more information.